We've got the inks done, and now it's time for a watercolor of Dave Chappelle. I'm Doug Tenape. This is a technique called wet on wet. That means I've laid down a bunch of water, and then I'm just throwing the lightest color on Dave Chappelle's face everywhere. It's, um, it's actually a really easy technique. It helps the colors merge together. So I'm putting some yellow ochre around the nose, a little bit around the nose. This is some burnt umber around the side, some burnt sienna all around the eyes and on the side here. And at some point, this is the problem with drawing faces. No one wants to put color anywhere. It's too committal. And faces have blended color. So that's what's great about wet on there. I just blotted in a highlight on there. Wet on wet, just all the colors start to merge. So it's a real good time to blend. Here I'm putting in the eyes. Uh, Dave Chappelle has very dark eyes and really these should be a lot darker, but I just like that warm brown. And all I'm doing is I'm at, I'm going, now that I have that bottom lighter layer, I'm just trying to find my darkest dark. I keep going dark. Now here's the trick with watercolors. When they dry, they're, they're almost 50% lighter than when you put them down wet. That's not true with gouache, but it is true with watercolor. It gets real chalky, especially the cheap watercolors I'm using. And I love my cheap watercolors. Lots of reds around Dave Chappelle's eyes. The whites of his eyes aren't even white. I'm going to end up putting yellow ochre on him at the end. You can see I'm just blending everything. If you end up finding that a line is too hard, I just dip the brush in water and pull it along the edge and it will soften all of the edges. But for the most part, this, I probably painted his face, I would say, I would bet there's four times, four full layers on each section. And really the biggest thing is just getting it dark enough. But um, his skin color is uh, a really rich brown. So there's lots of dark reds and dark browns going on that naturally blend together. And I'm always trying to warm it up. So keep putting those warm reds in the skin tone. It is a lot easier doing watercolors of blacks than whites because if I started putting red color or just color all over a white person, they start to look sunburned or they look like they have jaundice or something weird. <clears throat> but look at all these colors in Dave Chappelle's face. Um, it's just, it, it's almost like you can't go wrong. It's a lot easier to sculpt. It's a lot funner to watercolor. There's a lot more going on. I keep trying to bump up these shadows. They don't get, he's got these really dark circles under his eyes. And I just can't get, because every time it dries, it keeps lightening up. So I'll just go over it again with another layer. That's what's cool about watercolor is because water is part of the medium, it just naturally starts floating and blending things together. You can always put another layer on watercolor. And here, as it gets towards the end, we're getting more and more. The detail is starting to come out. I'm satisfied with areas. And there's Dave Chappelle. That was a watercolor of Dave Chappelle. Tell me what you think of it in the comments below.